Okay guys, we are back playing The Sims. It has been so long since we played last. I honestly, I don't even know how this much time has gone without playing The Sims. It's crazy. When we left off, it was about to be Harvest Fest, which is very exciting because it is our first Harvest Fest as a family. And I'm just really excited to have a wholesome time with my family. Here we are. How's everyone doing? It's been so long. Getting a little rest. And the babies? Also getting a little rest. Okay, so like I said, today is Harvest Fest. It starts in approximately four hours. I'm thinking we have to go big, okay? It's our first Harvest Fest as a family and we have this big gigantic mansion. I feel like we should throw a Harvest Fest dinner and invite over all of our friends. I mean, it would honestly be a crime not to because look at this, I have this giant table. Who's next to Finn under there? Who is that? Manabu. Who's this? Hazley. Anyway, it would be it would be a sin to not throw a Thanksgiving party in this house. I mean, it's it's fucking gigantic. I, it's probably the biggest house in the entire game. I mean, I I just have so much money. I should definitely share the wealth. Did I have a job? I don't remember. Oh yeah, I have a gig on Friday. The herbs. I'm all ready though. I'm all ready. I'm confident. I'm ready. Every everything seems to be going as planned. Wait, what's? I thought I heard a ghost. <gasps> I knew it. <gasps> Look who it is. It's Vanessa and she seems mad. It's Vanessa watching my, my big, gigantic, huge television. <gasps> What's she gonna do next? <gasps> oh my God, she's haunting Finn's bed. Uh oh. Oh no, Limey had a nightmare. Honestly, I feel like this is Vanessa's impact. She's like upstairs, like haunting shit. She's definitely also haunting Limey's brain. Oh, Limey is gonna go wake up Ned. Oh, that's kind of endearing. Limey's gonna go wake up daddy Ned because she had a nightmare. What, what about me? And not me. Wow, she likes her father more than her mother. Wow. All right, let's see what Ned's gonna do. Shives. <laughs> watch. That's all he's gonna do. He's just gonna watch her cry. Okay, let me step in, put to bed. She is starving though. I actually think instead of going back to bed, we need to feed her before CPS comes. Oh shit, I'm very playful. Oh my God. Okay, I need to get to the mirror now and calm down. And Ned, Ned needs to be the one to feed her. Oh no, it literally says in the top corner, Limey is very hungry. Be sure to feed her before she gets taken away. Why can I, why isn't he doing it? Emka Floof? Farina. Oh, the game must be glitching or something. All right. He's in a row. Yanka. Oh, Gosha. Why do they keep just talking about it and not going upstairs and doing it? Let me try this way. Give food to Limey. Let's give her peas. He's literally feeding an invisible baby. Okay, here we go. There we go. Oh, Limey, are you starving? Are you starving? To death? Like, to be honest, she is about to starve to death. It is like pretty close. It is pretty close. <laughs> Eat up those peas, girl. Eat peas. Is she even eating them? Okay, there we go. <laughs> and then she's just throwing them around. 
All right, so it is officially Harvest Fest now. The toddlers, they're too young to have any like goals or ambitions for Harvest Fest, but let's see. Me, my favorite tradition is holiday gnomes. And that sounds about right. Holiday gnomes, where are they? Where are they? I need to see them right now. Where are they? Oh, oh my God, there's one. Here's one right here. What the hell is Ned doing up here? He's just getting a little boxing in. What is his favorite? Oh, he doesn't even have a favorite objective for Harvest Fest. In fact, he ignores Thankful Spirit. Hmm. All right, well, I'm not gonna ignore Thankful Spirit. In fact, I'm gonna, I'm gonna schedule my, my Thanksgiving dinner right now. I'm the host. We're gonna invite Kato, the twins. Actually, I don't even need to invite them because they're here, right? Invite them so they dress up and do the goals. Oh, that's true, that's true. Because they need to participate. Okay, so. We're gonna invite the family. And you know what? I think we should make this a little dramatic. I think we should make this a little dramatic. I think we should invite my past lovers. Like this guy. Let's invite Thorn. Even though we don't really have like a love meter anymore, let's invite him anyway. Ooh. Let's invite Dirk. Let's invite my first fuck Santa. Who's my first fuck. So he has to be there. We gotta have Octavia. If we're inviting Thorn, we gotta have Octavia. And is orange here? Let's have orange, let's have orange. And then let's, let's throw in my friends. My friends and my coworkers. We'll get Vera, Supriya, Lily, Mehdi. Where's, where's Rico? We gotta have Rico, you guys. Rico's our, our um, babysitter. Rico should definitely be at Thanksgiving dinner. Let's invite him. Okay. Caterer, hmm. I'm trying to decide, should I step up and cook a turkey or should I have someone do it for me? The first person to answer that question in the chat said, do not cook. Okay, we're hiring a caterer. What was I even thinking, to be honest? <laughs> what was I thinking? Okay, it will be at my house and let's start at like 6 p.m., okay? Okay. You know what? I will cook the turkey, okay? Because I'm thinking about it now. I'm going back, thinking about previous times I hired a caterer. They cook the most random food, okay? And part of the Harvest Fest is having a grand meal. So I'm unsure if they're even gonna cook a grand meal. I feel like I need to cook the grand meal myself. And then the caterer can cook all the appetizers and everything else, okay? So I'm gonna get to it. You know, wait, I, I honestly think I'm not too bad at cooking. Oh, I'm maxed out cooking. I knew it. I'm literally level 10. This is not, okay, this is not even gonna be an issue. All right, let's cook that grand meal right now. Wait, she's playing The Sims? Wait, I'm playing The Sims as my Sim named Jen McAllister is playing The Sims in The Sims. Okay, so let's, let's whip up this turkey and then we'll put it in the refrigerator for later. All right, someone needs to come get Limey and let her out of here. How's Lemony? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You know what? Forget about Limey. Forget about Limey. We got to get Lemony up in the high chair and stat. Oh. Oh. Limey's about to die now. All right, well, get down there, Ned. Get down there, Ned. Shit, very hungry. Get down there, Ned. Oh, here we go. All right. Here we go. Let's give Lemony, let's give her peas. My turkey's finished. And it's excellent quality. Let's go. I'm gonna pop that in the refrigerator for later. Wait. What? What's going on here? Why is the game glitching out so much? Ned just took the peas away and my sim gave her animal crackers. She's about to die of starvation and I, I'm giving her animal crackers? Someone in my chat said big balls in Ned's mouth. 
Better than nothing, that's true. I'm gonna ignore that. Where's Limey? Limey is going back to bed. Limey's lifestyle is honestly one I wanna live. Sleep, eat, sleep, eat, sleep. Ooh, we should take Lemony to the, the potty, to potty train. She's about to shit herself. Potty train, Lemony, okay. Oh, how sweet. How sweet. How cute. Okay, time to potty train, Lemony. What's my Sim doing? Oh, of course. Posing for paparazzi. Oh, you guys. The gnomes. And the big one, the big gnome that I put in my daughter's room as decoration, it's, it's teleported. Oh my God. Oh my God. First, I have the big man in the corner of my children's room as decoration that kept getting put away in the toy box. And now the big gnome is teleporting around the house. I just cannot win. Like when will I figure out a decoration that will stay still? You know what? I'm going to kick this gnome over. Ooh. It escaped for now, but I'll find it soon enough. I will find that gnome and kick it. <gasps> there it is. There it is. Kick. Wait, why is my camera all the way down here? Here we go. Oh my God, I didn't know it was gonna turn into a pile of dust. It's literally a pile of dirt and dust on the ground over here. What's, and what's this? A rare crystal. Hmm. Enable emotional aura. Get back over here. You gotta like clean this up. Scavenge for parts. What's going on with Lemony? What the? I leave Lemony alone with Ned for five seconds and she's literally making a, a mess. Why is she red? She's sugar now. Oh my God. It's because my Sim gave her animal crackers. She's throwing a, a sugar temper tantrum. Oh my, Ned, you need to scold her right now. Give a talking to. Give a talking to right now. Joyful Mel. Keen. And clean that up. All right, what the f is going on up here? <gasps> Who's that? There's a new gnome. They're all so pissed off and there's garbage everywhere. I don't even know what to do. Oh. Oh, no. oh. oh my God. The gnomes are everywhere. They're making a mess. They're all pissed off because I, I kicked one over and they're just destroying the house right now. Ned, you need to sacrifice yourself and critique this work. Uh, and Shalbo. I'm just kidding. Ned, you need to sacrifice yourself and appease him. Oh, we can't even appease it. I'm getting in the bath. Okay. Everything is breaking. Everything is breaking. I need to hire like a repairman. Hire a service. Get over here now. Where are they? They're ruining my life. Oh, here they are. Appease them. Why can't I? I can't appease them. Jen has angered the gnomes. The gnome high council will now pass judgment on the gnome kicking monster. Okay, so well, how do I say sorry? Girl filler piranha pond W piranhas. Sims will jump into it and possibly die. Add some drama lol. I have a piranha pond? This is a piranha pond? Oh. I had no idea. 
I had no idea. Sharks? I'm filling, I'm sorry, I'm filling the pond with sharks. I'm filling that up with sharks right now. Get out of the tub and go fill with sharks. This is fucking crazy. I had no idea that you could do this. <gasps> Stand back. Stand back. Oh my god. <gasps> what? And what, what do I do with this? Get out of here. You gotta stand back now, Jen McAllister. <gasps> oh my God, admire, play, jump in. These fucking gnomes just following me around my property. I saw someone in the chat say that I have to just kick them all so that they stop. So let's get kicking. You're over. <laughs> you guys are over. Oh my god. Alright. Clean this up. I know my sims never worked a day in her life. Oh, There's even more. Get kicking. Get kicking, girl. Get kicking. <laughs> and I, I got a gooblek. I got a gooblek. Oh, and I got a romantium. All right, let's throw away everything. And I'll take these. I'll take my goo black and romantium. Thank you. What's going on over here with Ned? Oh, Ned is bathing our daughter. How sweet of him. Which one is that? Oh, it's Limey. How sweet. Oh, how sweet. What is he doing now? Eat peas. All right. Oh, I forgot about my rain, rain boards. Let me put that in my inventory. Oh, I fear my sim is gonna piss herself. Oh my God, everything's broken in my house. I didn't even realize the TV was too. I did not realize that. Those gnomes really fucked me up, didn't they? Okay, where's Ned? What is he doing? Oh, he's being such a good dad. Like he's fully taking care of the children while my Sim, like she won't clean up around the house. She won't pick up the trash and she's going and posing for the paparazzi outside. Like she literally, she's doing nothing to support this family. I'm not gonna lie. Besides, besides having a big, big bank account. I mean, I am supplying the entire mansion and my millions of dollars, so. Everyone can get over it. And my Sims just, she's going to pose for the paparazzi. All right, this baby should go to bed because it's almost Harvest Fest time. It's in two hours. I gotta decorate for Harvest Fest. I'm having all these guests coming over and stuff. So let me put up some decorations. Oh, how sweet. Look at that. Oh, we got the, the triangles down here. Oh, and on the fence. Oh, it looks beautiful. And there's also, oh my God, it looks, oh, it just looks amazing for Harvest Fest. I also think we should go down here and set the table. We should set it with fancy. What do you guys think? Triangles, border, desert, or dots? The first person who wrote in the chat said border. So I'm gonna do border. Honestly, Ned should go take a nap. He should take a nap or something. Um, Cause he's running low on energy. Are these babies sleeping? Okay, good. They're sleeping. And me, I'm working up some, some hunger for tonight's Harvest Fest. Oh, what a beautiful table setting. How beautiful is this? Oh, yes. It looks amazing for the dinner party. We need another table. You know, I was thinking that, but I was also thinking that some people could sit up here. There's four seats here. And some people could sit here as well. There's 16 seats and there's only 15 people coming to the party. So I think we're gonna be good actually. Oh, I gotta clean this up. My house can't be dirty for the party. 
Clean empty plates. My sim, like, all she wants to do is pose for the paparazzi. And she doesn't want to put in any effort for this party. It's, like, actually blowing my mind. You know, in fact, I feel like we should get some actual, like, decorations. Ooh, we could get this. Pumpkin trio. Oh, this is beautiful. Let's put this by the door. Yes, this is gorgeous. This is just gorgeous. And let's put another one over here. Oh, wait, fall branches. Fashionable fall br branches. This is just what we need. Oh my God, that looks amazing. That looks amazing. Interior decorator. Oh my, absolute slay. Oh, here we go. This is what I want. Oh, that looks so good. That looks so good. I think we're ready. I think we're ready. Those are definitely leaves. I know, right? <gasps> Dinner party in one hour. Oh my God, I'm so nervous. I don't even know what to do with myself. You know what? I think my sim should take a nap as well, just so we're all rested. Okay, get napping, you guys, get napping. <gasps> 20 minutes, 10 minutes, five minutes, two minutes, one minute. It's happening. It is happening. It is happening. Wait, huh? Finn's running away? This is so fucked up. Why is Finn running away? At literally right when the party starts, Finn is running away. <sighs> Let's start, I guess. This is so fucked up. Oh my God, wake up. Wake up and change. Let's change into, ooh, should we be really formal or should we just do party? Oh, <sighs> I forgot this is the party outfit. I completely forgot. And you know what? Wait, this is actually so on theme because Harvest Fest has to do with all those gnomes running around. So you know what? We gotta put that on right now. Put that on and we've gotta post, we've gotta post something that Finn's missing. Okay, the way my sim can cry on demand is a little like sociopathic, I'm not gonna lie. And who's that on the table? There's animals everywhere and none of them are Finn. This is so fucked up. Oh, he hasn't left yet? People in the chat are saying he hasn't left yet. Well, where is he? I'll just lock all the doors. He's right here. Yeah, right, you're running away. Yeah, f***ing right. I'm locking the doors right now. All pets. Good luck getting out, Finn. Where is he? Oh, here he is. He, he's like, what the f*** do I do now? Good luck getting out, Finn. Oh my God, you guys, look. Ned got into his gnome outfit all on his own. He's ready. He is ready. This is too good. This is too good. All right, I think we need to hire a mixologist and we should also hire a pianist. Finn, where the hell do you think you're going? I'm gonna give him some attention. Cheer up. Pick up, hug. Look, there we go. He's not gonna leave now, you guys. Give treat. There's no way he's leaving now. All right, how are my girls doing? Are they in their outfits? Oh, they are. Oh, look at Lemony's outfit. Okay, Lemony needs to wake up now too. Lemony looks so cute. Okay, come upstairs. Oh, Finn's oh, definitely not leaving oh, now. Oh, He's like inside my suit. Oh, no. He's literally inside the suit. Oh, there he is. Is he happy now? Feel the love. <gasps> Thorn, close the doors! Oh, it's not even Thorn. Who is that? Oh, Yamato. 
Thank us. What a cute outfit to come to my Harvest Fest party in. I'm gonna say thank for coming. Thank for coming. Look how cute the girls look. I'm gonna make them play with each other because they need to have a little bit of fun. <gasps> Everyone's coming, who's this? Everyone's coming, this is so exciting. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna introduce myself to this guy. Or Ned is, I mean. Oh, let's feed Finn as well. Oh my God, she looks so cute. She looks so cute, oh. Look at them. Oh. Oh. Please, I'm begging you to show him the shark pond. Oh, how do I show someone else the shark pond? Oh, hello. Thank you so much for coming. Wait, guys, where are all my guests? I invited literally like 15 people. It's 8 p.m. We should get started on eating soon. And not only is my caterer not here, but only two of my guests are here. This is, what the hell is going on? Also, where's my bartender? Where's my pianist? Oh my God, this is this is going awfully so far. You know what, I'm gonna have to get on the, the piano right now because we need to get like a little bit of entertainment going here. Get over there, Ned. I'm busy thanking the guests for coming, so. And the guests are just standing here doing nothing. Oh, here comes Santa, here comes Santa. Oh my God, this party is so dry. We're halfway done the party. It's it's dry as fuck. It's dry as fuck. Oh no, what do we do? All right, I think we gotta bust out the turkey, you guys. All right, here's the turkey. Oh, who's that? No, don't. Uh, I need this. Bitch, this bitch just came storming into my Harvest Fest party and just grabbed a slice of turkey before I even got to call everyone to the grand meal. Oh, how rude is that? She just ran in here and took a slice. Oh my God. All right. Well, anyway. It's time to eat everyone. Thank you so much for coming to my party. Everyone come get a plate. Come on girls, come get a plate. Oh, all the guests are here. Oh, here we go. Come on, Ned. It's time to get a plate. Hurry before everyone grabs one first. Grab a serving. Oh, look, everyone's sitting at the table. Oh, Ned, eat this plate, eat this one. So we can sit next to each other. Oh my God, here it comes. Yes. Yes. This is giving such grand meal vibes. It's giving grand meal. Oh, yes. So, you guys enjoying yourselves? Oh my god, of course Thorn would show up in this. The fuck? Thorn, are you trying to outshine everyone? It's not that kind of party, Thorn. Who, where's the bartender? This is get. Oh my god. This, this is awful. You know what? I'll make drinks for everyone. I'll make virgin. Drinks. Actually, no, I want everyone to get lit. I'm gonna make Cupid juice. I don't even know what that is, but get over there, girl. I'll make that Cupid juice. Why is this party so dry? This is the driest, this is the driest party ever. Like, oh, who's, who's going downstairs? Oh, who's that? Is that Octavia? It is Octavia. Oh, Octavia's in my bedroom. She's going to use my bathroom. Oh wait, she hates my toilet. She hates my toilet so much. Where's the music? Where's the pianist? Oh my god. I can never throw a good party. I can never. I see you guys in the chat saying, they need music to dance to. I, that's why I hired a pianist, because I wanted this to be a fine, high class 
party with a beautiful pianist on the keys that we could all listen to, but they never showed up. So listen, I'm just gonna get like a stereo and we'll just have to listen to that instead. Ooh, this is fancy. This is fancy. I like this. What colors does this come in? Ooh, that's not bad. Let's get this party really started. Turn on. Let's listen to Retro, my favorite Sims station. Yes, we got the Sims 2 beats. Where'd the music go? Here's the other one. Oh no, it's over? It's over? Oh my god, it's over. The party's over. I said it says, well, it was a party at least. You'll find a consolation prize of a gently used book in your Sims household inventory. Oh no. Oh my god. Well, what book is it? Cooking volume one? I'm cooking level 10. Okay, you know what? I can at least try and have a good harvest fest. All I need to do, well, Ned over here, he doesn't need to be thankful and there's no more gnomes. So he's kind of a lost cause, but me, so far I'm doing pretty well. I just need to have thankful spirit. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let me get up here and like start being thankful. Kiss hands. Oh my God, I can't. I can't. I need to be thankful. Be thankful. There we go. Go be thankful. Oh my God, stop. Oh, this is so embarrassing. Two people came in the same shirt. Are they not embarrassed? They're literally standing right next to each other. You guys came in the same shirt. <laughs> How embarrassing is that? You guys should be across the room or something. Oh my God. That is just so embarrassing. I'm gonna go over and be thankful to them because I'm feeling bad about how embarrassing that is. I'll be thankful to this one too. Oh, I got it! I got it! Dude, I just noticed that like everyone's like dying and by everyone I mean my babies. They are like about to pass out. Why are they even up here? Oh, it's because I forced them to come up here and dance. Actually, I did do that. <gasps> what is Santa doing in their room? It's a little creepy. He's playing in their toy box. Like a f***ing freak. Just saying. Why is he- What is he do- Get out of here, you freak. What is he doing? Get out- <gasps> He's going into the girl's room. Oh, he's mourning. He's mourning Vanessa. <laughs> oh my God, this is bad. This is bad. How is he even in here? This is bad. I, the fact that I have Vanessa's urn and he's witnessing this. Oh my God, this is bad. I'm gonna go down here as Ned and rudely introduce myself and tell him to get the f out of here. I'm not gonna blow my cover as, as myself and rudely tell him to leave because he might find that suspicious. Get in there. Get out of here. What are you doing in my children's bedroom? <laughs> Rude. Dance. Watch no longer. Get out of here. 
Sawada Habibi. Mean. Go away. Insult. Uh oh. One of my babies just passed out. Get in bed. Why is she not getting in bed? Oh my god. Get get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Neely. Get. Uh-huh. And stay out. Oh my god. I can't be that irresponsible like again. I need to lock the door. Lock the door for everyone but household members. That was seriously like a a close call. That was seriously a close call. Santa honestly knows too much now. Like the fact that he sees her urn in here, like it is suspicious. I mean, Vanessa goes missing. No one knows what happens to her. And then her urn is in my house. It is suspicious. And I'm just worried that Santa saw that. I mean, I know he's a good friend of mine. Like we have been friends for a while now. He was my first, he was my first Honestly, so I think, I think we'll be able to keep a secret, but I am just a little bit nervous. I mean, where where is he right now? Where is he? Oh, okay. He seems normal. He seems pretty normal right now. He's actually helping out around the house doing chores. Maybe he doesn't he doesn't care and he's not gonna blow my cover, but I don't know. He could be putting on a front. Oh, I'm just stressed. Yeah, good idea. Get in your pod, girl. When you're in the pod, you're shutting the world out. You know what I mean? Pod on, world out. Meanwhile, upstairs, still so many people at the party. Music's blasting, it's a little chaotic, but pod on, world out. Finn has to pee so bad, but listen, I saw you guys all saying that, but I can't unlock the door because he's gonna run away. So I don't know why he's just not peeing on the floor. Like, just go ahead and pee on the floor, Finny. We'll clean it up. Oh, everyone's leaving. Everyone's leaving. Oh my God, I'm so nervous about Santa. Wait, why is he, he's walking out with his head down. Everyone else is looking normal, like they had a good time and Santa's walking out with his head down. It's almost like he's like ashamed that he knows this. Oh my God, he's guilty, he's feeling guilty. He's feeling guilty of what he saw. I think he might have to die. He may have to die. I just don't know though, you guys, because if we kill Santa, like who's gonna bring gifts? And honestly, Christmas is coming up. Winterfest, it's in less than a week. And it's gonna be my daughter's first Winterfest. So who's gonna give my daughter gifts? All right, music off, party over. Can my sim stop going and taking pictures of the paparazzi? God damn. <sighs> you guys, I'm not gonna lie, like feeling a little bit discouraged after that party. It just did not go as planned. It did not go as planned to put it bluntly. I mean, I really tried to go all out here. I, I mean, I cooked my turkey dinner at 6 a.m. I hired a caterer. I hired a bartender, a pianist. None of them showed up. None of them showed up. And then the party, it honestly just flopped. I mean, when I busted out the stereo and everyone was dancing, I, I thought it was gonna, I thought it was gonna be a little bit more lit, but it just kind of flopped. And I'm just a little bit upset about it. Honestly, just embarrassed I even tried. The guests only came for the clout. Honestly, they did. At least they cleaned up after themselves. I'll give them that. Oh my God, the paparazzi is taking a picture of me while Finn's shitting on my shoe. Can she just give us a moment of privacy? Please. Oh, you guys, my Sim, she's freaking out again. She's always so playful. I'm afraid she's gonna die. Let me save the game really quick. Oh my God. Oh my, this paparazzi. She's literally taking photos of me standing in a piss puddle next to a pile of shit. This is so humiliating. Get back inside. Get back inside. <laughs> Hurry. Hurry, go here. I can't let her see me like this. Oh my God, this is so chaotic. Why is everyone dying at all times? Everyone's always dying. So let me try and get everyone situated. Finn's running away? After all that? Oh, no, he's not. 
Oh, no, he is not. No, he's not. Good luck. Good luck getting out. <gasps> How did he get... No! No! Finny, no! Finn, where are you going? Finn, where are you going? No, where are you going? Please, where are you going? Come back. Oh my god. Hashtag come home Finn. Come home Finn. Please. This isn't even fair, Finn. I take such good care of you in every single episode. But in this one episode, I tried to throw a party and I gave you maybe just a little less attention and you're, and you're running away? Come home, Finn. No. Post alert about missing pet. Oh my god, you guys. <sighs> Damn. Finn running away has honestly just crushed my spirit. It's ruined my mood. It's making me upset. So I think I'm going to end the episode here. And hopefully in the time between this episode and the next episode, Finn will come home. Please. Finn, please come home. I need your help in the YouTube comments. Please comment, come home, Finn. <laughs> He, he may only come home if you comment, come home, Finn. Otherwise, I think he might be gone forever. And you know what? He may only come home if you, if you subscribe to me on YouTube and follow me on Instagram. Especially follow me on Instagram. I think that might be the only way that Finn will come home. So, please guys, just follow me on Instagram and, and then Finn may come home. And just pray. Keep him in your thoughts and prayers for the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed this. I mean, it may have been hard to because our party flopped and then our dog ran away. But I hope you enjoyed it anyway. And I will see you next time. Bye, YouTube.